Yo, what is going on guys? It is Get Scared here and welcome back to another Black Ops 2 commentary. It has been a while since I've done one of these, I'll admit it. Um, I think my last two Black Ops 2 videos have been live commentaries and uh, there's also been some Minecraft videos mixed in there and all in all I think it's been, um, I don't even want to guess it. <laughs> it's probably like a month and uh, a month and a half or something, I don't even know. But whatever guys, um, this is going to be the last episode of Nuclear With Every Gun on my channel for Black Ops 2. Uh, unless I somehow get another one, which I highly doubt because I'm not really playing public matches at all in Black Ops 2. Pretty much the only thing I do now is play League Play. And that's when I play as well because most of the time I don't even play this game. I'm just completely burnt out on it. But anyway, hopefully you enjoy my last Nuclear um, that I got. This is actually really old too, uh, I just never really had a chance to upload it, I always wanted to upload my other nuclears for some reason, and I just never got around to uploading this, so yeah, it's a late upload and all of that, um, and yeah, it's with the SMR, I didn't have any attachments on it as well, so I guess that's an added bonus that makes it a little bit better, I didn't have the adjustable stock, which is my all-time favorite assault rifle attachment, and I didn't have fast mags either, and I didn't have a sight, I had to use the shitty ass iron sight that this gun has. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed that. I did have six perks though, so I guess that kind of makes me overpowered in another way. And uh, yeah, that's. Uh, I don't really have a commentary topic for today. Um, I guess I'll talk a little bit about Call of Duty Ghosts because it is right around the corner. And I've been seeing some very interesting videos lately, um, actually. I haven't really been like staying super up to date on Call of Duty Ghosts news um, like some people have. Like, I was a lot more interested last year when Black Ops 2 was about to be released. Like, I was literally, like, watching every single video possible on information for Black Ops 2 because I was just so hyped. And Call of Duty Ghosts, like, I don't want to say that I'm not excited because I definitely... I, I think I definitely am. I mean, it, it looks like a pretty solid game. Um, and it... Like, Black Ops 2 was a little bit of a disappointment, honestly. A lot of people hated this game. I still find some enjoyment to it. Like, I, I find it a decent game. And Call of Duty Ghosts looks like a pretty solid game, so I feel like I should be a little bit excited, but at the same time, I don't want to get my hopes up and then have them crushed like a fucking ant. Um, or a spider, because I like crushing spiders. I fucking hate those things. But what the fuck am I saying? I'm just going completely off topic now. Uh, anyway, so, yeah. Uh, I've not been staying too up to date on the news of Call of Duty Ghosts, but I have been watching videos today. And uh, there's lots of videos going around on how the prestiging works, and I just thought I'd share my thoughts on it real quick, because, um, I don't know, it's it's a bit different from other games. Obviously, Black Ops 2 was a bit of a change with the whole uh, Prestige Master thing at the end, which I actually quite enjoyed. And it looks like they're doing something very similar to that. Um, I'm sure most of you guys know that... Basically, when you have an account on Call of Duty Ghosts, there's going to be 10 characters with uh, each... They each have their individual levels, like you rank them up individually. Uh, I'm pretty sure most of you guys know that. That was kind of like announced when the actual Call of Duty multiplayer reveal was uh, revealed. So, yeah, um, about that. So, basically, every single character only has one prestige. So, with 10 characters, that equals 10 prestiges. So... Basically, it's just like other games in the sense that it has 10 prestiges, and once each player prestiges, they just, they're just they automatically prestige master, basically. Like, they have everything unlocked. And, uh, yeah, that's basically how it works. Um, I don't, I'm not sure how I feel about the whole, like, multiple character, like, multiple uh, soldier thing. Um, I kind of like just the right way it is now. I don't really want to overcomplicate anything, but, you know, it, it doesn't sound bad or anything, but... Yeah, let me know your thoughts in the comments below, um, and uh, yeah, let me know if there's anything else you want me to talk about in the remaining days of Black Ops 2, um, because yeah, I'm just uh, I'm just really bored of this game right now. Um, I'm I still have a ton of gameplay saved up too. That's the thing. I just don't have anything to talk about, so I don't really want to make any videos or just me rambling on about random shit. But anyway, guys, hopefully you enjoyed this commentary. If you did, make sure to drop a like, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a good one. Peace!